In recent years, there has been a steady rise in the popularity of K-pop and Mandopop bands, their members excelling in multiple areas of the entertainment industry, rising to fame with the emergence of the K-pop boy band Unique. Lee Won Han is an accomplished vocalist, actor, and dancer who was featured in various TV shows, including Idol Producer, which paved his way to some of his most recent ventures. Lee Won Han has been the subject of various dating rumors over the years, often in association with the same woman. Whether this is based merely on speculation and the dreams of his fans, or on fact, this has only increased the attention he has received in the media. A simple reminder: how to enter our brand new giveaway. We will be giving either an iPhone Max, iPad Mini. Or MacBook Pro. It's really your choice. All you have to do is watch the full video, leave a like, comment the keyword hidden in the video, subscribe, and turn on notifications to enter the giveaway. It's really that simple. Li Wenhan was born on the 22nd of July 1994 in Zhejiang, China. His father, Li Jian, and mother, Wang Jian, have remained as incredible supportive forces throughout his career. There has always been a level of mutual respect between them, and they enjoy a secure and happy relationship. His mother relates a story about when Li Wenhan first developed an interest in girls and dating during junior high. Li Wenhan was active on the internet from a young age and would use the internet as a resource to answer his questions about life. One day, his mother came across a question of his that he had posted about dating. And wanting to assist her son but not embarrass him, she created an account of her own, posing as a teacher, and sent him a reply. She told him that having these kinds of thoughts during your youth is not a bad thing. This is a very natural physiological occurrence, and cautioned him that if this affects your studies, then the gains are not worth the losses. Lee Won Han was grateful for her advice, but didn't find out that it was his mother until years later. Lee Won Han is an excellent swimmer. His first experience with the sport occurring when his father threw him into the water as a child. Lee Won Han grew up in the. Town of Hangzhou, the hometown of Chinese Olympic swimming medalist Sun Yang. The proximity allowed Li Wenhan to train with the accomplished swimmer. At the age of 15, Li Jian decided to send his son to the U.S. to further his education and open more opportunities for him. Li Wenhan returned to Beijing at 16 after a year of schooling and commenced four years of intensive performance training. Li has also trained in classical guitar. Li Wenhan started making television appearances long before he debuted as a singer. He appeared as a guest in multiple shows from the age of three. In 1997 until 2013, including Happy Camp in 1997, Weekly Idol in 2011, and After School Club in 2013, he also began receiving recognition for his other abilities, appearing on a JSTV reality diving show in April of 2013. During his stay in the U.S. in 2009 and 2010, Lee Won Han took the opportunity to audition for Yuhua Entertainment, a Chinese-based entertainment and talent agency. His audition was a success, and he was one of the first members to be recruited, who would later become a member of the band. And unique, like the other future members of the band, Li Wenhan had to undergo four years of training before the band appeared in public. Li Wenhan, Zhao Yijing, Wang Yibo, Cho Sungyong, and Kim Sungju appeared on M Entertainment on the 16th of October 2014 for the debut performance of Unique. The five performed their song "Falling in Love" and were accepted into the industry with much aplomb. They officially released the single a few days later, closely followed by their second song "Born to Fight" on the 23rd of October for the TV show Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. They released two albums the following year, EO EO and Best Friend. Most of their songs are in both the Chinese and Korean versions, due to the mixed ethnicity of the group and aiming at a wider audience. Their instant popularity was so notable that they were subject of a limited reality TV show, The Best Debut, which aired in December of 2014. The show was streamed on iQiyi and aired three episodes. However, in light of rising tensions between South Korea and China, all Korean entertainment was banned in China. This was devastating to the group, as two unique members, Kim Sung Joo. And Cho Sungyeon were Korean. Although the group did not officially disband, they were unable to perform together and were forced into solo performances in their respective countries. Won Han has appeared in multiple television shows, both as a reoccurring cast member and as a host himself. As Unique gained traction and a steady following in both South Korea and China, he was offered a position on the South Korean talk show Ni Hao China and became a host of the show from April to August of 2016. He helped educate viewers about the various aspects of Chinese culture, tradition, and economy. 
in a friendly and entertaining format. But unfortunately, the same political tension that tore the band apart also ended his tenure on the show. However, this didn't end his career in television, and he hosted the Chinese sports show The Players from June to September that same year. He also made appearances in The Chamber of Secret Escape in 2018, Roast in 2019, and Amazing Dinner in 2020, and is the main host of Perfect Summer that year. Along with his prestigious talent as a singer, Won Han is also an accomplished actor. As a K-pop artist, a lot is expected of him. He can't just be capable of singing and dancing, but must be an actor and proficient in multiple hobbies. Lee Won Han made his debut as an actor in 2016 when he had a minor role in Personal Assistant of Female President in the first season of the series. In 2018, he began landing more major roles as Prince Lee Jing Yu in My Naughty Classmates, an historical drama series set during the Tang Dynasty era, and in 2019 as the main character in Adventurous Romance. In late 2018, Lee Won Han announced to his followers that he would be appearing in Idol Producer, a competition that would see the battle of 100 potential boy band members for a coveted position amongst a nine-member Chinese band. Lee Won Han did not just survive the competition, he excelled in it, winning multiple challenges and, ultimately, the entire competition, earning over 8 million votes in the final episode. The final nine on Idol Producer became the band now known as U9, with Lee Won Han as the leader and main vocalist of the group. The group made their debut on the 6th of May, 2019, with the EP single Unlock, and on the 21st of October of that year, their next EP, Unusual. They celebrated their first anniversary with the release of their first album, Unite Flight, on the 6th of May, 2020. Lee Won Han enjoys a varied and active lifestyle. Although he has adopted the Korean name Moon Han while he is there, he is affectionately nicknamed Han Han by his friends. As mentioned, Won Han was an excellent swimmer in his youth, even winning the Hengju Junior Swimming Competition, but it appears that his abilities stretch to include diving and basketball. He is also very musical and can play both piano and classical guitar, in addition to his incredible singing and beatboxing. Surprisingly, Lee Won Han is inactive on the dating scene. Although we know that he has dated in the past, he is currently single. However, this hasn't prevented fans from speculating and guessing where his romantic interests lie. One commonly reoccurring rumor is that he is dating Wang Zui, an actress who rose to fame when she played a close friend of the main character in the series A Love So Beautiful. After it was rumored that Woon Han took her to the Yuhua 10th anniversary event, the fan base blew up with supposed proof that the two had been dating for ages, but no evidence, including that he took her to the event, was ever presented. This didn't put a dent in the rumors, and when fans began bringing up the topic again, and Kuiji, colloquially referred to as Chinese Valentine's Day, Wang Zui finally addressed the rumors, with a post stating, This is the second time already. Please don't bring me into this anymore. I am single. Thank you, everyone. Like many K-pop artists, Lee Won Han enjoys playing with his style and appearance. While he was known for dyeing his hair red during his early days as unique, he currently has black hair with a fringe. He is 5 feet 11 inches or 1.8 meters tall, and weighs around 140 pounds or 64 kilograms. He is always immaculately dressed with a definite sense of style. Won Han's net worth is around $500,000 as of late 2020, and he is widely regarded as one of the wealthiest K-pop artists. He also isn't afraid to share that his favorite brands include Armani, Givenchy, and Burberry, a selection that can only be supported by a substantial income. Thank you for spending some time with us. Make sure to like and subscribe so you never miss another video. We also handpick these videos, which we recommend you watch next. You can talk to us on all social medias or ask a question in the comments below. Thank you for being with us and we'll see you back tomorrow.